like FCA, this was a huge loss for Ferrari. So Ferrari investors, owners and dealers all asking the same question this morning. Who is Lewis Camilleri and how will he change the most storied brand in autos and racing? Now, the stock down about 5% this morning after the company named Calamari. He's a current uh, Ferrari board member as the new CEO. He had been the CEO and chairman of Philip Morris, and he was accredited with expanding sales of Marlboro cigarettes and lots of other brands overseas. A lot of people question whether a non-car guy can actually run Ferrari. Now, Marcel Massini, the top Ferrari historian, an appraiser told me, quote, Ferrari is all about emotions, style, success, and drama, and buyers want a leader to identify with, and a true passionate car guy would certainly be a big help. Now, Ferrari has been a big success under Marcioni's plan to take it public, expand production, and expand the number of models. He, Calvin Larry will have to oversee a huge transition as Ferrari right now launches an SUV and goes into hybrid engines. You know, people who have worked for him uh, tell me that Camilleri is disciplined, an intensely hard worker, and he excels at managing large global companies. So he might actually bring slightly better governance and structure to Ferrari. He's also passionate about the Ferrari brand. Now, Marlboro, we might remember, sponsors the Ferrari Formula One team. And friends tell me Camilleri is a frequent attender of Formula One races. He knows the Ferrari team well. And he also, this is important, has a large collection of his own Ferraris. I spoke to a dealer this morning. He said, quote, I own a dealership, I own Ferrari stock, and I own lots of Ferraris. Let's just say I'm not selling any of them this morning. So this is a guy who, even though he came in under sudden circumstances, could actually be a very strong positive for this brand, guys. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.